Hey, what's up guys? This is Chris at windsand.com. This Logic Studio tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to quickly create a crescendo effect within your mitts. And remember, if you ever have any questions, comments, or ideas, you can always get a hold of me, Chris at windsand.com. The first step is to select the region that you want to place the crescendo on. I'm going to place it on this hi-hat region that's very basic, sounds something like this. All right. Now the next step is to go up to MIDI, scroll down to transform, over to crescendo and select. All right. Now it's a pretty basic plugin. There's not too many options, but you do have a few to work around with. Basically you have your starting position where you want the crescendo to start and your end position where you want the crescendo to end. You have a few more options right here, but I'm not going to go into that. As of right now, you can mess around with that on your own time, see how you like that. So um, I'm just going to keep it at the default settings, having it start at the very beginning of the track, then have it just go four measures in. So once you have all this selected to how you want it to be, simply go down and hit select and operate. And that's all you need to do. And now my hat track sounds like this. A nice little crescendo in my four measures of play. Make sure you follow Windsound on Twitter and Facebook to stay connected to a stream of new videos as well as cool music production links. Twitter.com slash Windsound or search for Windsound on Facebook.